Mind maps are fantastic tools that help you visualize the relative importance of and clarify links between ideas. They can help you quickly generate new ideas and think more creatively. Particularly at the beginning stages, mind maps can help unlock the potential of your project. ZenKit's mind map view is a very simple tool that you can use to create mind maps with existing data or to create a new collection from scratch. When you're creating a mind map from scratch, the first step is to create the root item. Click on the button in the middle of the map and type in your idea. You can then start creating the different branches of your map by clicking on the plus icon and dragging them out. If your collection already has a few items in it, you'll see them in the Unconnected Items panel. Click on an item and drag it onto the item that you want to connect it to. To move items around, just click and drag them. To move around the map itself, you can also click and drag in any white space. Scroll using your mouse, or use the navigation overlay. To return to center, just click on the center icon. Another way to get a better look at the map or different parts of it is to use the zoom toggle. To declutter the map for a clearer look at your main ideas, click on the little folder icons to collapse or open branches. You can also remove items from the map without deleting them from your collection. Open the Quick Start menu and choose Remove from Map. If you need to remove an item completely, click Archive instead. The archived item will remain on the map until you remove it using the Remove Mind Map method. If you want to completely clear the map, choose Clear Mind Map from the Quick Items menu of the root item. This won't delete any items from the collection, just take them off the map. Each time you create a new mind map from existing data, it'll create a hierarchy field for that map. Like all fields in ZenKit, you can have multiple hierarchy fields, which means that you can create multiple maps for the same collection. To create a new hierarchy field, go to the Views menu, Mind Map, and click Create New Hierarchy. This will create another completely blank mind map, which you can then populate with your ideas. You can only edit a hierarchy field inside a mind map. If we switch to another view, you'll see that field, but won't be able to make any changes to it. To change the name of a hierarchy, just rename it like normal. And that's it. Hope you enjoy using them. Oh.